good morning i decided to do a new what i eat in a day video uh holiday edition so i'm just gonna be showing you very simple very clear what i eat in a day during the holidays uh yeah that's pretty much all there is to it there's gonna be other things involved as well of course i don't know all i'll show you throughout my day but at least you'll know what i eat and I apologize, I'm trying to talk loud because we do have the dishwasher on. So I'm going to now, well, first off, get some light in here. We got these really super warm lights and uh, it's not so bad. They're low energy, so yeah, but the color is a little off. And I've also been told that the color is off on my device regardless because Apple. So I should clean off the counter Super quick, super quick Super, super, super quick Actually, not just that, but first thing I had is um, water was all the way up to the top and I thought I should actually film this while I'm drinking my water First thing that went into a system today of many. Yeah. Oh. Also, need to take vitamin D3 and then the mental pills. Because <laughs> we don't want our brain to be the enemy of the rest of the day. Yeah, I don't need water to, uh, I produce enough slave that I'm able to just write them back. Done. Also, I'm aware that I'm always crooked on this line. Well, not always crooked, but hello. Don't know if I'm going to be putting on something else on top of this shirt, but feeling cute today. Again, feng shui in my kitchen. Feng shui in my kitchen. And now, sorry for, sorry for boobs. We're gonna just get in here to get coffee. Coffee, 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 coffee. And I also probably make the, not probably, and make the same breakfast I've been eating for quite literally eons. Uh, I just love it so much. It's super simple. I'm, <laughs> I'm sure it's not gonna be exciting for anybody who knows me. I don't think I, I don't know if I have done. What's the last time I a what I eat in a day? I don't remember the last time, or have I ever done this, but either way, holiday edition, uh, cause I'm gonna do things I don't normally do and things that I've not been normally doing. Like, uh, yeah, during the holidays right now, I've been enjoying some bread, I've been enjoying uh, cookies, uh, chocolate, all those sweets, but I only do that when I want them in the moment. I know I don't need them, but I want them, and then having that wherewithal emotion. So I just made, should have showed you, but I've done that in a previous video as well. This is my coffee. I fill her up, I then throw some deep marine uh, collagen powder, Canadian made. We love to support Canadian things as much as we can. And then grabbing an ice cube, I should, I need to wash my other ice cube tray. I also probably need to fill this one up too because it is dangerously low. Mm -hmm. And we just lost a cube on top of that. Lovely. I just hit the ground for like two seconds. Mm. Sure, why not? Why not go crazy? Let's put two cubes in today. Which means there's only one cube in here. I can fill her up. Yeah, we're gonna fill her up.
for our breakfast. One of the three ingredients is frozen cherries. Yes. Actually, take some the cherries. And I do like a handful, which used to be between like five and six. Beautiful. Six little guys. Boom. You also have natural peanut butter and then skier, plain. Um, I try to go for a high, uh, higher fat percentage on my skier. That is that. Keeping, keeping teaspoon of skier. Delicious. And just finished my first glass of water of the day. I constantly drink water, which is probably why I constantly have to pee multiple times a day. And unless I'm in the office, like the like my actual work office, I kind of don't drink as much water because I'm just focused in on doing the things. And I think it's also just the ease of me just running down, filling my glass, and running back up to finish the rest of my day. Sing on glass. Now full. This is about 15 ounces. So. Yeah. <clears throat> don't worry, I'm not gonna be. I don't. I don't know if I'm going to be counting all my water that I'm going to be drinking in the day, but easily just chopping up the cherries. Yeah. yeah. And so I'm going to dig and get into this. I just try to break out down the peanut butter a bit because it's just in this giant clump. So I've got to get all that peanut butter goodness. Probably not going to eat this right away. I'm probably just going to have a few sips of my coffee and enjoy that. Well, I, well, I don't know. Maybe I will have my breakfast first before I get a little cuter or a little bit more refined, a little bit better about how I look. I mean, I already feel better. I have a shirt on and energy. So this is, we are batting a thousand right now. <laughs> So check in now for the next bit of food. I washed some grapes. I'm definitely not gonna eat all the grapes. I just chugged a lot of water and I was gonna trying to chug my second glass of water so that I would be able to then fill it up again. But I got back to the quarter of um a quarter of the or like a maybe a bit more than a quarter of the glass was finally done. But then I pour the rest of it and more water into this water bottle, which is a hundred, sorry, it's 1.5 liters, 100 liters, 1.5 liters. So I'm going to just keep on chugging this throughout the day. I'm not going to chug. Chugging hurts. I just learned that. I'm going to have some grapes. going to keep on drinking my water. I already finished my second cup of coffee. We are doing good. We are, we are being well, we are being fed, we are being satiated. Yeah. This is lunch. I've already kind of demolished my uh, Brussels sprouts, but I did an open and face sandwich, toasted the sourdough bread with butter. It's got avocado and this gorgeous bit of sirloin roast that Ryan made last night. It is so good. Yeah. Just been munching away at it and continue to ply away at, not ply away, why? God, my brain, I'm still drinking my large bottle of water. Yeah, and before I completely demolish it, I just wanted to do a quick little video just to show you what I ate for lunch. As I said, oof, poor uh, angle. As I've said previously, that I don't normally have bread too often, but uh, this is the last bit of my open face sandwich. And I am obsessed with this sourdough bread from Buddha Belly Bakery. And I have still the remaining lab. I made this like almost this whole loaf like in less than a week. 
so I still have some in the freezer, but uh, it's just so good. The best way to eat it is with, um, and I love how my lipstick is just here now, so I'll fix that eventually. Not now, because we're still eating. Same thing with this little bit of avocado on the side here, but mm, still so good. So good. So I'm really enjoying this then. I'm about to hop on a couple more meetings. I attended one while thankfully I was on mute for the majority of it, so that was nice. And so I was able to eat my lunch after having my lunch break finished, and yeah. Gonna keep on carrying on. Hmm. We'll fix it. <laughs> I also decided to be even cheekier and have a couple of grapes as well. Excellent. This is me trying to give a side thumbs up. Awesome. Alrighty then, it's about well, 10 minutes to 6. I am behind my normal food schedule. But let's see, what do we want to have for a veggie snack? Yeah, let's go with these little carrots. Mm. Do we want to do carrots or do we want to do cucumbers? Let's do cucumbers because we might roast these later. Yeah. Cucumber time. All right. That means, oh, sorry. <laughs> right near them. I'll just put you on the ground. This is a super flattering uh, angle. Where the hell are you? I was gonna eat you. I had a plan. Gonna eat you. And then I ran. Ba -do -do, ba -do -do -do. You can burst. Alright. Let's just take, yeah, one, one big boy is good. I'm not that hungry right now. The benefit of having sometimes bread is that you get satiated longer. Well, that and also I had a crap ton of meat and veggies, so that also helps. I love how I'm talking into this, almost like it's a microphone, and I'm just checking myself out right now at the bottom, so that's great. Mm. Let's see how we get through with this. Again, talking like it's a damn microphone. I don't know. Yeah, I just gotta try on those shoes. And then I gotta get my husband's ass into gear so we can go out shopping again. Yo, keep gumber microphone. <laughs> Are you just gonna watch me eat have my whole snack? Maybe. It seems like the plan right now. Okay. Hmm. Okay, I found it. Okay, I found a couple of things for the stocking that I was panicked because I couldn't find them, and now I found them, so yay. Excellent. Good on you, cucumber, and walking around while eating. This is probably the most annoying footage I've ever filmed, like, in the world. I've also been listening to Natalie Jean's uh, Where Am I album on repeat. So hence one of my things that are still in my ears. And I just brought you out right now just to film this because I needed to eat. All right. No, that, that was absolutely annoying. Yes, my bowl of my breakfast. Still just chilling outside the sink. That would drive some people 
crazy. And if you are that person, well, I made all your crazy points because I was talking with my mouth open. Well, of course, that's how you, I was chewing with my mouth. Talking with my mouth full, chewing. Oh, well, you got it. You got it. Let me go try on the my dancing shoes they're not blue suede unfortunately but they will do the trick so that's actually a, a great little christmas thing that i can finally talk about because this year's not been rolling much christmas and i apologize uh for anyone who was really expecting that i mean no shit it's vlog this christmas season you were spending more christmas part of that bit but fortunately not so, Ryan's, one of Ryan's uh, beloved childhood favorites from this time of year, is Elvis's Blue Christmas. I think that's very sweet because that's a song that normally sometimes if I'm not in the mood, I'll skip. But now that I know that was one of his childhood faves, I never skip it now. That is all. Let me go try my shoes. Do you want? No. No, that's a, that's a foot thing. It's like, do you want to watch me try on the shoes? I'm like, mmm. You know, I'm not precious about people seeing my feet on the internet uh, because they're, like, so janky. I have ugly ass feet. And uh, so if anybody... I thought that the cupboard was open. But if anybody with that ugly ass foot, foot, feet fetish uh, wants pics, I'd say no, <laughs> but at the same time, I'm a, I'm a little concerned if you're really into fucked up feet. Like, I mean, no shade, but I'm curious. Can we can we talk about it? I want to talk about it. I want to talk about it with you. Happy to give my feet for money, but <laughs> I need to talk about it with you first. I need to charge my phone because it's about to die. But these are why are you so? These are great. I am a very happy. Ooh, look at the board. Oh, so nice. Even though they say dance, I'm trying to ignore that. I know I could snip it off, but it's kind of kind of cute. Is it cute? Is it cute that they say dance on them? Can it focus on the dance bit? Is it cute or is it not cute? Should I get rid of it or not? Let me know. All right. <laughs> I'm still a bit hungry. So, we are consuming grapes, or grape tomatoes. Well, colorful little cherry-ish. You're loomy, you're, we're having tomatoes. Crucify people. <laughs> wow. Jesus who? <laughs> That's literally what his name would be, Jesus who? What kind of contraption do you think he would be on? This is Dr. Seuss. So I, I don't even want to know or <laughs> answer that question. Mm -hmm. Well, what we ponder about Jesus who, um, and what Jesus who would be, probably candy canes would probably be what he would have been crucified on. I'm having a caramel bar as my next bit of what I eat in a day. We just got back from dance. I tried on a lot of beautiful dresses. I did not realize how expensive ballroom dresses can be, but we made a commitment to do this event. Um, the last thing I ate was I ate that caramel bar before dance, and then I also had like a little uh, shortbread cookie as well that I did not show myself eating, but I did. And it's about, yep, yeah, it's literally 10 21 p.m. So I think because it's how late it is at night that I'm not going to have dinner. I think that's the, I don't know, baby, what do you think? Baby, mm -hmm. do you think I should eat food? Or do you think I should just go to bed and not eat dinner? 
The only reason I'm asking is because like I'm not hungry. And that's why. Mm. Mm. I don't know, I just part of their bed. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to bed. I'm gonna keep drinking some water. And I'll see you next time. If <laughs> If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe. It absolutely makes my day when I see a new subscriber. Also, don't forget to ring that notification bell because every time a bell rings, an angel gets its wings. And as always, thanks for playing. You'll be getting a video from me every single day leading up to Christmas.